back once again um today we are going to look out for something very simple on our resistance zone um you know we have only two zones once the market is turning down it turns to be a resistance and once the market is turning up it turns to be a support so right now we have a resistance as we speak and when we draw our zone our resistance zone you can look out for good touches we have three of them and that is an opportunity presented so when we look out for our exit points um, the reason why we look out for exit points because we expect the market to turn the other way around so it's never one direction the market has to move all the way up and all the way down so right now let's look out for those zones where the market can possibly make a u-turn in the weekly so we have our support zone down here this is the first zone where we expect the market to turn from so those are going to be our exit points so when we see the possibilities of this trade the possibilities of this trade and the trade is happening today uh, on Monday it's a fresh entry on Monday the reason why I call it fresh entry we are looking out for a lot of things and one of the things we've seen it's a rejection on a resistance zone and we have an evening star in the daily time frame such confirmations those are the reasons why we make our entry and uh, our entries are going to be made in the four hour time frame so what do we expect in the four hour time frame when we apply our resistance zone you can see that we expect this market to make a slight movement to the resistance zone then later move to our direction so that's what we expect to see today and we are waiting for it so once such an opportunity is presented we are having a win-win um let's check out another trade um you know australian dollar i've been making analysis and i've checked a lot of things as you can see the zone the resistance zone i've drawn let me draw it once again you can see that it has been respected for some good weekly almost for a full month because these are so many weeks and for today we've seen a strong bearish angle thing which it's a sign that the whole of this week we are going to have a strong sale so that's the candle we expect to see this week so how are we going to drive such an opportunity so right now when we we see there is a breakout in the daily time frame and 
our entries are going to be seen in the four hour time frame so let me draw the zone once again So what do we expect in the four hour time frame? We have that zone and we have this zone as well. So it takes time to learn to draw support zone, a resistance zone, the collect way and to draw it sometimes it's hard. But when we keep on practicing it, we get it and it becomes very easy for us. So right now what we expect, we expect to see this market making a slight movement back to that zone. And later on, move to our direction. So what do we expect from here is so that will be our take profit and this entry is for today as well. So we expect to see signals formed in the four hour time frame to make our entries we need the market to retrace slightly from a bearish angle thing or a tweezer just like we have here that is called a tweezer just like the one we have there so that will be a signal for us to sell. There's another signal here as well. That is a bearish engulfing. It's another signal for sale. So such confirmations, we use them after making a very good analysis after drawing our trusted reliable support and resistance zones but to draw all that you need to go back to the past and see what it is happening then you collect all the data and the trade is open but according to what I see, the market is moving in our direction as we speak for now. It's just moving in our direction. I've not finished the video yet, but the market is moving in our direction. So, which simply means the signal, I don't know, but the market is already in our direction. And we can't make entries at this time because of um spread can spoil it so we have to wait for spread to settle a little bit then we are able to make our entries but on such a big spread we can't make entries we are thrown so far away from the right entry so that's it for now it is silent trade Voila.